Hello everyone, so in my previous video I talked about PyWall which is a great utility that allows you to set a color scheme based on a wallpaper and it generates one for you and it automatically sets it just makes your life a whole lot easier and today I found out a way to change my entire system color scheme with PyWall so whenever I set a wallpaper which is the way I have configured it so let's say I set this you can see how the bar of the changed my terminal has changed and my wallpaper has changed so how do I do that well let me just tell you how it is so first of all I have a wallpaper picker script which I will leave in the link down below so if I head over to that script select wall.sh I believe it's called yeah here it is and the main part in the script aside from all of this which basically allows me to pick a wallpaper with Rofi here which is the app launcher these the these commands these commands are the most uh, important lines in here so while dash i wallpaper path sets or generates a color scheme from the wallpaper that i just selected and then it reloads weba and that's it that's the script and now if i want weba to use these colors which it will not do by default all i need to do is head over to my weba configuration and then first add in this line link in the description as well which basically just uses this file right here so what that file is if you go to whatever terminal you have and cd dash dot cache slash wall and then ls to list all of the files in here there should be quite a lot of files so you just need to create a file called colors waiver dot css if it doesn't already exist and if you create it it will already add a whole lot of stuff to that uh, to that file so for example if I open it up paper.css you can see how it already has all of this this is just added automatically when you create the file and then you just import that file right here in your waiver waiver style style file so style.css and then you just change all of the colors in here from like a hashtag fffff which will be just pure right to add background for the background color or add foreground for the uh, text color and there are a lot of stuff here like add uh, all the color 9 or color 3 and all of that so where do I get these variables from well we can just open that file and you can see this color 0 color 1 color 2 these are the colors that are going to use by Weber so just pick any random one doesn't really matter because once you change your wallpaper it changes and this one takes quite a while to reload I have no idea why so if I just pick another one like painting 10 there we go now it reloads and now we have a different Weber painting uh, 4 that's a really nice one and now it has a different looking Weber and that's pretty much it so now I never have to worry about changing my color schemes going through this configuration file going to this style file changing this and changing that I can just pick any wallpaper that I want and it will automatically set color scheme for that wallpaper based on that wallpaper and it fits all my needs so hope this video helped and again I'll leave all of these links in the description and bye bye